what's up guys I'm doing a skin giveaway every video what you have to do to enter is like the video subscribe to my channel and as third send your ID in the comments the winners will be announced in the outro as you can see here in the bottom left good luck to everyone what's up guys and welcome to another guide in this guide I'm going to explain how to use Hayabusa the shadow assassin Hayabusa is a very strong hero very agile, very mobile and very hard to kill but he deals tons of damage. He will dive the turrets without any problems. He will heal so much damage he's done and he's just very very fun to play. This, in this game you see I got my first pen to kill and uh, since Hayabusa is pretty hard to play uh, I will uh, teach you guys how to play Hayabusa. So let's start off with the summary. We uh, start with the pros and cons but then we have some general info then I explain uh, the abilities and how to use them, which is the main part about Hayabusa. Then the combos with, of the abilities. Then the best builds. Normally I have only uh, two, uh, have two builds, but this time I only have one build since uh, I think it's uh, it's the best build. Then we just uh, talk about uh, the tips and tricks and how to play him. And uh, we see a game how to play him. So the pros about Hayabusa is that he has a high area damage because of his ultimate. And also his first ability deals damage in an area. He's very strong in 1 vs 1, especially when there are no minions nearby or no jungle monsters nearby. His ulti will, ultimate will deal a lot of damage and he can heal the damage also. Also, Hayabusa is very unkillable because with his second ability, you have 4 shadows to teleport to and you can completely uh, make your enemy uh, clueless where you will be going and it's just very nice. You can even uh, dive the turrets with it, which, which is very nice. Also. Uh, since you are building a cooldown reduction on Hayabusa, you will have very low cooldowns. So you can just spam your abilities a lot. So, at the cons, uh, when you spam all the abilities, you will use a lot of mana. So, blue buff is really necessary on Hayabusa. So, you gotta be uh, you gotta be careful that you always have the blue buff because your mana pool will be uh, will be just empty very very fast. The ult targeting of the Hayabusa ult is uh, it's a bit bad because um, when there are minions nearby the ultimate will also target the minions so when the enemy is nearby uh, standing between minions you should kill the minions first before you use your ultimate because uh, it will uh, it will target the minions a lot and you will do a lot less damage than you will you, you will do when there are no uh, enemy minions. So uh, also Hayabusa is very hard to play. So you have to be a bit practiced uh, with Hayabusa, so after seeing this guide you should definitely try him out first, uh, get understanding of the abilities, just play against bots because you don't, be f you don't want to feed against, uh, against real opponents and your team will hate you and uh, report you for that. So be sure to just uh, practice a bit with the abilities. So some general info about Hayabusa. Hayabusa is an assassin shoe. So you definitely want to focus the enemy uh, squishies like the um, enemy marksmen or mages. You can just use the ultimate on them where there are no minions nearby. And you can just uh, destroy them really really fast. But as Hayabusa, your role in the team will be just to assassinate the backline. And uh, just uh, slow the frontline a bit with your first ability as well. So you definitely should focus on that and not just focus the tanks and uh, die with your team. So the passive is called... In Yutsu, Shadow Heal. When you use abilities on an enemy and you hit them four times, you will get a heal. The low HP you are, the more heal you will receive. First ability is called Phantom Shuriken. It throws out three shurikens, dealing damage, and uh, you can hit all the shurikens to deal even more damage, up to 200%. So standing close to your enemy will uh, up your chance to hit all the shurikens. It also slows the enemy. The second ability is called Quad Shadow, doing 4 shadows in a, each direction uh, towards you which you can teleport to. It also slows down the enemies. As you can see, you can teleport to all the shadows and you can aim them with your ability. It also slows down the enemy. The ultimate is called Oogie Shadow Kill. It does damage all, to all enemies around you and you will be invisible and invincible during the ultimate. Each hit will increase the damage, as you can see. You can also use the ultimate just to clear the wave. Let's take a look at the combos of Hayabusa, which are very, very important. So the first basic combo is without the ultimate. You use your shadow towards the enemy, use your shurikens and then go back to your shadow. 
this should be done as fast as possible. So second ability is use your watch shadow, then use ultimate, then your first ability, and then you can win. So as you see, in game I dash to the enemy, I use my first ability first, then use ultimate, and go back to my shadow. If you do it fast enough, you won't get a tower shot. Again, as you see, I do this again, this time with four enemies, and I go back to my shadow. Just getting a little bit of damage. For the first build, and the final build, you can see uh, it's a 30% cooldown reduction and um, and some uh, just basically a lot of damage. Like I don't have any defensive items, only the fourth item is a bit defensive, but it also gives a shield and uh, a lot of damage. So the first item gives you a 10% cooldown reduction, a lot of physical attack, and it gives healing on every uh, ability you hit. Second of the uh, boots is just 10% cooldown reduction, which is really nice. The third item is Hunter Strike. It will uh, give you 10% additional uh, cooldown reduction and a lot of physical damage, which you will need. The fourth item will be a bit more defensive because it's very nice to get a bit, uh, get a little shield when you are low HP, and it also gives magic resistance, which is really useful. So the second last item is the armor penetration, which is really really strong on high boost. It will deal a lot more damage because when you're uh, above uh, 70. Percent HP, I think it is. You will deal 70% uh, armor penetration uh, more damage, so that's awesome. And the last item is just uh, a very, very big physical attack boost, uh, boost, giving you 130 physical attack, which is really awesome. So now let's take a look at the tips and tricks for Hayabusa. I will be doing a commentary with the Hayabusa gameplay, entire full gameplay. So uh, definitely check it out to learn the more. Uh, specific details about Hayabusa and I think you will learn a lot from this gameplay. I hope you will enjoy. What's up guys, welcome to another gameplay and we are playing with the Hayabusa now so let's see uh, if we can get any kills. Um, we already have, are in a fight with this and with our uh, friendly Cyclops because he wants, wants to go top and he wants to take, um, he wants to take our uh, blue buff. So I uh, actually normally, normally I use Purify, but in this case I use Retribution to get my blue buff because I really, really need my blue buff on Hayabusa. It's very important because I cannot spend my ult uh, my abilities and ultimates, so it's very important to get the uh, blue buff. But I think the Cyclops will troll so hard. And uh, yeah, he was just saying Russian words and they saying I will go top lane. I said oh we are pre made top lane, let us go top lane. But uh, he doesn't understand. He doesn't want to understand. So. Uh, Yep, some people are like that. So will he? Okay, he's okay, he's not going top lane. So finally, he understands that. Uh, I think he saw we are glorious legends, so he will. He's just going mid lane. Let's take this one first, and we go uh, to the blue buff. I like the skin really much. It's a uh, it's a nice skin. We have to do the bloop, bloop fast because they are pushing our wave hard. Let's use the shadow to be even more more fast. It wasn't really needed, but okay. Just to be sure. I don't have my retribution, so we have to be fast before we lose minions in our tower. Rip. Oh, I actually thought the enemy would take it. But he didn't do it. He might have died for it anyway. When he tried. I want to use my shadow to finish off the kill, but uh, Lee kills still already. Rip. So our ultimate is almost uh, up again. That's nice. Let's clear jungle. I think we might go back then, or maybe clear another wave. We will see.
Let's see how's Harley in the mid lane? Is she full HP? Yeah. Let's just defend our lane and then we. Oh, I, I get my might get me heal back. Yep. Then we can <coughs> can clear the blue buff again. I can't use my shadows, what the hell. Who has his ultimate so he can just kill him? Nice, good job. Good job, Lee. I need this blue buff really bad. What, he really got us? Oh my god. I guess uh, second ability does a lot of damage. Oh, that's why you got it. I need it way more than Cyclops. They really want to kill me. Oh, I want to use my ult. Oh, I didn't see Harley come from back. I actually thought it was Lee coming from the back. That was my bad. Yeah, he's dead. Let's help. They will die too. Nice, good job, Lee. I think the boop will be up soon, so let's do it. Go for it. Or he might did it already. Attack time. I don't know. Stowed him, nice. I think he did the blue buff the second time without me noticing. But as you can see, I really need blue buff, so let's buy this all we can. We have no for space. Don't need to use an ultimate now. Or do I? Oop. So now I can use it for Roger. We can go for top wave. Then we go back to get our mana. Doing blue buff. He's waiting for it. Yeah, rip. I can't uh, get it now. Let's go top lane. There are three top lane. She was uh, sneaking up behind them. Uh, he got spotted.
We need to kill the Roger fast. Okay, nice, we got slow. We got still on our Harley too. Okay, he flashes out. That's smart of him. Now oh, rip. Oh, yeah, not in range for the uh, ultimate. I could have killed him. I, I hit my ult. I was in range. I was, was a free kill. Up, boop, boop, boop us up. I don't think we can get it. Okay, we can get it now. Oh, so close. I will die for it too, probably. Yep. Oh, wow. I survived? How? What the hell? How I survived? Let's see. They're fighting in the bottom lane. Going into that table will instantly ult me. Okay. Don't forget this high boost, of course. to go for the kill. Oh, I missed it. Oh my god, that's so bad. I want to really want to go for the kill. Nice, we got him. Oh yeah, Bruno got it, but still. Take the blue buff now. Oh, that was a uh, poor ultimate. <laughs> it immediately stopped because the enemy was dead. I want to go in for the kill now. Is he kicking him? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm getting <laughs> I was in a spot with it. The fountain couldn't kill me because uh, the game ended. That was lucky. Almost died. That was a fun game to play. That's really fun. 15 kills, 2 deaths, 12 assists. And the MVP star. That's awesome. 34% team damage. Nice. That was a good game. That was a really good game.